Hey guys, welcome back. Today I am here with my April and May body care empties. Um, my, I'm going to preface this by saying if you are interested in my home fragrance and wa uh, candle empties, they are in my wax melt um, and home fragrance empties video. I did put them at the very beginning. I did have uh, several Bath & Body Works candles and a Bath & Body Works wallflower, but the rest was all wax, like vendor wax and then store-bought wax. Um, but I did put those at the beginning of that video in case you want to hop on over and just watch the first like two minutes of that video. They're on there. I've decided to do my body care empties every two months because I don't empty enough body care to make it worth doing a video every single month. Soaps, on the other hand, I go through about 3,000 soaps in two months, but... Uh, body care I really don't so um I will preface this by saying I am we are a family of four um I am home all day I'm a stay-at-home mom my kids are now on summer break so soaps will be flying away um I'm going to do after this I have one more video to do today and that is my summer uh challenge which is for candles and body care I don't do wax melts as part of the challenge because my changes my senses for wax melts change daily I could be in the mood for a winter bakery scent in the middle of July. So I don't I don't want to commit myself to certain scents for um, for summer on the wax melts, but I have my candles, my home fragrance, I have my body care, my soaps, and my poppy backs in that bin. So I will do that video next. That's for my summer challenge. That's gonna start June 1st and go through September 30th. On to my body care. I went through a few scrubs. Um, some of these I had helped. My husband and my daughter helped me with these. Not to look like a complete Looney Tune, but anyways, um, I'm not that, I mean, I love scrubs, but I'm not that crazy. So I went through a sample I got from the bathing garden in lemon cheesecake. And this one I actually love so much. I grabbed a full size one in my last order. These uh, sample sizes, these are good durable plastic containers, but these sample sizes, I get seven, eight uses out of these samples. Um, this was just a nice citrus cheesecake. And then I used up this candy carousel one same thing very nice um it was a light candy scent but you get several uses i'm going to repurpose these because they're so nice rosemary's baby from super tarts it's bedtime bath rosemary mint herbal lavender this is one of my top five favorite scents from super tarts of all time it is gorgeous it is just my favorite calm me down to go to bed scent i love it i have several clamshells in it i want to pick up another with this if she ever restocks I had a sample scrub from Wilma's in Pumpkin Brickle Cookie. This one was awesome. It's a foaming sugar scrub. I got like three uses out of this and I went ahead and bought some um, wax in that scent for fall. This one my husband and my daughter used the majority of. It's Wicked Dough from The Bathing Garden. This was gorgeous. It was like a pumpkin dough, like a pumpkin cookie dough. My husband and my daughter went ate shit over this. And the last scrub is fried candy donut. This is my jam. I have three more of these in my cupboard. A uh, fried donut, fried candy donut is a uh, berry donuts rolled in cotton candy. Yeah, I have clams of this, and I have three more of these sugar scrubs. And these we do not use in the shower. These we use on our hands at night before we go to bed. What I do is I have a routine. I brush my teeth. I take my contacts out. I do the sugar scrub on my hands and then I put body cream or hand cream on my hands and that helps them not break out. All right, so I do have a couple, I'm trying to organize these as best I can. I have a couple miscellaneous items I'm trying to find. Well, maybe I only have one miscellaneous. Yep, I only have one, okay. Um, I used up a Primal Pit Paste deodorant in lavender. This is the only deodorant I use. I do not use mainstream deodorants. I don't like the parabens, aluminum, and all that junk that's in it. Um, this is only found on their website, primalpitpaste.com. We've been using it for a year. I go to the gym heavy duty, and I've never had an issue with, you know, sweating. So, for body care, we have gone through a few few things um i went through this sheer cotton and lemonade shower gel 
The scent notes on it are crisp, clean, or crisp cotton, sparkling lemonade, wild gardenia, mandarin blossom, and clean musk. I like this, but I like watermelon lemonade a little bit better. Um, it was okay. It, it served a purpose. I, I enjoyed it. I also finished up the matching fine fragrance mist. Um, the lotion, I haven't been using a lot of lotion, so the lotion is still full from that set. My daughter used up a winter candy apple shower gel, which is red apple, winter rose petals, candied orange, maple leaf, fresh cinnamon. She is nine and a half, and I've already gotten her addicted. She only will use Bath and Body Works um, shower gels now. And she also used up this coconut, cool coconut surf. Um, fresh coconut water, sparkling white pineapple, frozen citrus, granita. The winter candy apple, I want to say she finished about the first couple days of April. And this one she just finished a few days ago. She loved both of those. Alright, so I have some pocket bags that I've got to dig out. I have a lot of soap, so it's going to take me a year and a half to go through all these soaps. So I want to get through everything else first. All right, so onto the pocket bags. I used up a watermelon lemonade, which is one of my favorites. I have more and I will continue to buy. Peach Bellini, this is another one I have more of and I will continue to buy. Fresh strawberries. And sparkling limoncello. And I have one on my purse now that will be done probably in the next week or so and it's a beautiful day, but I will put that in my next empties because it's not empty yet. And it's sad because today's the 30th, but I'm going to be busy tomorrow, so I didn't want to do my empties tomorrow. But I have some things that will probably be done by then. Alright, so last, I'm going to move these over because last is all my soaps. And it's going to take the whole screen <laughs> to get these soaps out here. So I'm going to move all these over. I wish I had editing. I wish I knew how to do editing. Okay. This first one was Happy Easter. It's cotton candy. And the scent notes were powdered sugar and vanilla cream this I did not like it was too, the vanilla in it was very musky it was not a sweet vanilla like I thought it would be and it it repulsed me I did not like it in the least and I will say we have two sinks one in the bathroom one in the kitchen we go through on average one soap from each per week um and that's an average sometimes more sometimes less it just depends on what's going on and this is eight weeks worth of soap so there should be close to 16 here Spring poppies and picnics, um, fresh uh, starter picnics and wild poppy bouquets. This was nice. It was a nice spring floral. Watermelon lemonade, juicy watermelon, sweet Meyer lemon. One of my favorites. I went through a lot of watermelon lemonade. I went through a three wick candle. I went through um, a pocket back, a hand soap, and then I went through the. I'm going through the body care set right now. Next is Miami Mint Mojito. I really liked this. This one is Experience Paradise with a blended fresh lime juicy pear and green mint leaf. I really, 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 really like that scent. It was just a nice minty scent. And it was so nice that I wound up going through two of that. The next one is Vanilla Coconut. It's just a very nice, you know, vanilla and coconut and I really like it. The next one is Lovely Lemon Meringue, and it is Meyer Lemon Fluffy Marshmallow Vanilla Extract. I really like this one, too. White Lily and Lime I was using in the kitchen, and it's, you know, Lily and Lime. Really nice floral, a little bit of that citrus. Beautiful Blue Skies, Dewy Blossoms, Kiss of Citrus, and Sheer Driftwood. I really like this. I have, I think, two or three more in my stash. Jamaica Pineapple Colada, um, Experience Paradise with a blend of Juicy Mandarin, Green Pineapple, and Vanilla Musk. I really like that one. That's a really nice one too. That's more of a summer scent, but I wanted to try them out. Another Beautiful Blue Sky, so I went through two of those. Sweet Mint Mimosa. This was a lot like the Miami Mint Mimosa. Uh, just a very nice. Alright, two more. Pink Pink Peonies and pears. This one was really nice. It was a floral with a hint of fruit. And last, Bermuda Plumeria Sunrise. This is really nice. I actually really like this. So I had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 15. I had 14 soaps. So, like I said, I, I would have gone through about 16 or so in the two months 
that I was um, using them, but I only went through 14, so that was pretty good. So that is my entire uh, body care empties for the months of April and May. My daughter's sneaking down the stairs and into the bathroom. Um, so anyway, so I hope you all have a great day, and I'll see you later with my next video. Bye.